Hello. This tutorial is on a tool which helps you calculate the energy output using photovoltaics. So photovoltaics are solar panels that make electricity out of solar energy. The first thing you have to do is to put the location. So I've put London in the UK here. You click go. And then it finds the closest place for which it has climate information. Um, so if you look in the map, you can see that there's several locations for which there's climate information available. And it has chosen the closest one to the location I've been specifying. So I'm happy with that. Let's continue. I click on the red arrow. And then this new page appears, which has information that we need to fill in. You have little information panels where you can read out about each of the uh, boxes. So this is the size in kilowatt of the system. Um, you can use this. It's quite handy to try and draw your system on a map. So for example, we can choose a location, I don't know, say somewhere here where we want to put some solar panels. So let's say we want to put solar panels somewhere on this roof here. And I'm not sure whether this is a flat roof, but imagine it is. So let's say we want to put the panels here. I can just draw them. So this is going to give us an approximate capacity for the system, approximate size in kilowatts. Now, the thing is that it takes into account the flat area um, which has been drawn. If you have an angle to the roof, this is not going to be very, uh, very precise. It's just going to give you a much smaller area because, of course, the slopes are not represented on the flat map. So it just gives you an idea. So let's save this. We can see here the size of the systems changed. You can then choose the module type. So from standard or premium or even thin film, let's say we just choose a standard PV. The array type. So here you can see is the type of fixing that we have. So we can have just an open rack or something which is mounted directly onto the roof or um, a tracking system. So let's say we have something which is an open rack. And then the system losses are calculated here. So there's information about where this is. And you can even calculate them by changing this value. So it can just be left like this if you don't know what you're doing. The tilt is the tilt of the roof or the tilt of the PVs. So let's just put this at 20, it's fine. So you can explain here. So this is the tilt, the angle from the horizontal of the photovoltaic modules in the array. So if this fixed directly onto the roof, you need to put the tilt of the roof. And then the azimuth is the angle from the north. So if the orientation of the roof is straight south, it's going to be 180. If the orientation of the roof is north, then it's going to be zero. I wouldn't advise to put your PVs on the north side, though. So let's say we are straight south, or so it could be on a flat roof that the PVs are oriented towards the, the south. So in that case, I put 180. So this is correct. I just leave it. There's some advanced parameters here, which um, if give you, for example, the efficiency of the inverter, if you have a specific inverter in mind. And here you can choose um, a rate. So as we are in the UK, we need to enter our own value. Um, and of course, here it's indicated in dollars, but we're in the UK, so it's pounds. So let's imagine it's pounds per kilowatt hour. I put 0.1330 peak per kilowatt hour. And then I click on this arrow, and that will give me the total amount of energy 
approximately that this system would be producing per year. So that's quite handy. It gives it month per month. You can see there's more energy produced, electricity produced during the summer months than there is during the winter month. And also it tells you how much money is saved per year per, per the system. Okay, I hope this is quite a handy um, little tool for you to use. And thank you for listening.